Hello guys, my name is Chris and I'm the Tech Talk Doc and today we're gonna go ahead and make another tutorial on the Avery labels and stickers which people enjoy so much and are very helpful for people. So I got a question from somebody about how to add in how to add labels, for example, to each of these without using mail merge or you having to use the Excel spreadsheet. So let me see what I can show you and follow along. So let's go ahead and if you don't already have one, go to avery.com and log in if you have a login and do is let's go to templates, go to free design and print tool. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go to templates and go to free design and print tool. I'm going to start your design. All right. So it brings up all the different types of designs. I'm going to go to address and shipping labels because that's the one that I have. And that's the one that I use. And I know for a fact it's the 5136. So I'm going to go ahead and select that. So we've selected our blank label here. And we're going to look here at the software and again this is free to use it's a very strong software and you'll get a great outcome but first let's pay attention not to the left side but to the right side and this is the key point do we want to edit all or do you want to edit one when I say edit one are these all going to be individually different or do we want them all to be the same so if we go to edit one all right and we go to text and we go to add text box and I go to easy text fill and I type in what I want to type in for my inventory information you'll see what happens so if we hit apply and I'll just do my regular formatting as I normally do let me go up to size 14 and we'll bold it All right, so you see what happens is it only does one of 30 and you can see because the rest are blank. That's why if you want to make the entire sheet all the same because you have say 30 products that you need to put stickers on, go to edit all. And when you hit edit all and you put in your text box and we put in the you can see it automatically filling. All right, so this saves you time, energy, so you don't have to go individually do it. And you can see here in the small version. Now what I wanna do is, I wanna preview and print these. Well, it's not gonna take you to the Word document, but it'll give you the PDF, which is just as good, all right. So I want to go to uh, preview and print, but first I want to save it. All right, I'm going to save it. We'll just save it as this right here. And it's been saved. Now I'm going to hit preview and print. And this is what it's going to come out as. Now I can get the PDF to print. And they have a video of tips for printing yourself, but let's go ahead and get PDF to print. And you can read over here. They tell you about how to make sure the settings are correct, custom, and all that. Let's hit download a PDF. It's now downloaded it to my computer. Let's go ahead and open it. And there you go. I test printed it. Came out perfect. So this is a better way to do it using Avery's free software. Instead of having to manually copy paste each text into each of the uh, sticker boxes. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions, please comment. And if you have not yet subscribed, please subscribe. Please follow and follow me on the other social media. Thanks for coming. Come again.